Ready? Good to go, man. Right when the kids come back inside. Yeah. <laughs> All right, guys. Thanks for coming back to Mill American Outdoors. We've got uh, July grab bags here from Bowhunter Box Club. Yeah, we're just going to go ahead and do a tandem reveal. See what we got. Get at it, Jake. All right. This is my third one, I think, that I've yeah, got. Yeah, I think it's the third third grab bag overall. And I think I got in on the uh, quick clutches that he was going to throw in there this month. Uh, a certain time, he posted a live video, and we went on and got them um, included in that for free, I believe. Which one just fell out of the package, so that must mean... <laughs> They opened up, but it looks like the shirt says nice. blood, sweat, and deers. Yeah. Um, that, they said they were going to make a pretty neat one this month, and I would agree with that one. Um, I'm sure a lot of them are the same on the shirts this month. I'm not sure. They said they were going to make a few different prints, or they were making a few new ones. Yeah, they're all, all these clutchings that are loose in my bag. <laughs> the, just the box here <laughs> is it but, just a wrap yeah it's the wraps i've used oh, these so uh yeah it's just the wraps without the veins not quick um, clutch nope not the clutching on them which i've had these before i've used them uh on my pre some previous arrows when i didn't really know much about clutching they're pretty simple just dip in boiling water <laughs> We have to add the fudgies to these ones, which ain't that big a deal. Could probably use those sometime down the road. But uh, my other item is the Cyclops. Can't have enough of those lights. The Cyclops mini light. Nice. I've had I've had a few of these as well, which can't go wrong with throwing them in vehicles and you know hunting bags, hunting packs. You never know what you end up with. I'm looking for Let's see. Let's see. Oh, it's different. It's different. <laughs> My shirt's the same. Yep. Same old, same shirt. Same great That's good material. material. Good material. Yeah. I wear those that material all the time now. And it fits for this time of year, man. Sweating in July. Trying to work yeah. trail cameras in the Midwest is, I don't know, I guess maybe where you're at, it's not quite as thick as river country over here, but it is. <laughs> no, we just got dry, dry heat, rattlesnakes, that's about it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Here it's like, in these river land, the river area here in Nebraska, it is like just a swamp and the reeds are up six foot tall and it is yeah. horrible. Yeah. to try to get around out there but you gotta do it if you want to have any chance in the fall especially on those public properties heck yeah sure. so got in on those wraps as well and then i got broadheads all oh, the redneck ones yeah yeah those are good good fixed blades for you know, coyotes or anything that walk by your deer stand. Absolutely. So always put one of these arrows, one or two of these arrows in your quiver that are yep. a little fouled up and throw some of these cheap, cheaper, excuse me, cheaper broadheads on there. Yeah. These are ones I was sure messing around with when we got them back in a box, you yeah. know, a year ago. And I cut my finger wide open. <laughs> Yeah, messing around with the yeah. blade on these things. Those are NAP, NAPs, aren't they? Yep, NAP rednecks, and they're the replaceable razors. Yep. Like I said, NAP makes a good broadhead, as I've said plenty of times. But, uh, I don't necessarily use fixed blades, but I do on coyotes. And uh, Yeah, pretty good box. Uh, what are you guys doing in Kansas soon for deer? Fixing to get out trail cameras. Got some more batteries ordered. 
offline because they are expensive here in town. So <laughs> waiting on them to come in, and then here this weekend uh, should have a free weekend to get five, six cameras out. I hope. Like I said, my ground that I usually hunt around um, walking, hunting, and some uh, uh, private. Um, just not much food source this year. It's all dry. We haven't had rain for a, quite a while up here. Um, yeah. The corn's still there, you know, in some spots, mostly on the higher ground. So maybe some spot and stock you might be able to see. Maybe, maybe catch a mule deer this year. Who knows? We found Kinda. You got a nice mule deer right behind you, right? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah my first mule deer. But, He's decent. Yeah. Yeah, nice one. Hopefully, maybe get another similar or bigger. Try to always go bigger. <laughs> <laughs> well, maybe we could get some footage this weekend from you on your working yep. cameras and some tips for those guys. Yep, absolutely. Be getting in the bedding areas. Try to find the corn if I can find some and get in somewhere around there. <laughs> Try to find some water if I can, but yeah. everything's dry. Oh, it's God. real unique where, real, real unique where you're hunting because you've got the ability to hunt true whitetail yeah. style, tree stand style, as well as spot and stock mule deer in the same county any day. Yeah. Yep. And travel just an hour or so and be able to hunt antelope too to the south. But <laughs> I, I've never been able to do that. And I hope to someday. You never know. Yeah. But, uh, yeah, we got quite the variety up here, which I'm, I'm definitely glad I live here for that reason, for sure. <laughs> yeah. But, cool, yeah. man. Well, it's a good box or a good grab bag. We still got the boxes coming later in the month. You're still in on the, the monthly box this month, right? Yep, absolutely. It uh, should be coming here soon. Sweet. So we'll get the monthly box up here, the full draw. Maybe yep. get something coming from you from scouting and working the trees. Right now yep. I've got uploading here in the next five minutes will be a, a video on cam lean and cam tuning um, timing. It's an addendum to our VXR build series. And uh, yeah, make sure you guys check out the 250 subscriber video. Um, we've got one week until we do the drawing because we finally hit that 250 mark. Um, Pretty exciting, man. Yeah. Got the bull rolling, yeah, and cool. September's coming. Yeah, yeah, definitely stay tuned for that. I mean, we got some good content coming. I can feel it. Yeah. <laughs> Put in the work, and you never know. Yeah. So. Cool. Well, yeah, have anyway. a good night, man. Yep. You guys, peace out. Yeah. See ya. See ya.